Do you have to have a 740 in order to get the best financing? No, you, you don't have to have a 740 to get the 0% financing on the vehicles, the good credit cards, the no money down loans. You don't have to, but generally they want it. I'll give an example. Last August, I bought a new Toyota. I had just maxed out all my credit cards. We were doing some other stuff for business and we had just bought an apartment complex. And so I'd maxed out all my personal credit cards. And so it dropped me below 740, but I still got the great the great financing with no money down with Toyota. And the reason was because I had a Toyota before with Toyota and I had a loan with Toyota Financial. And so because I had good payment history with them in the past, they look the other way on the credit score. You will never be approved for something because of your credit score. So let me repeat that. You will never be approved for a loan or a credit card because of your credit score. Credit scores do not get you approved. They only get you denied or they get you in the door. See, if you have an 850 FICO and no job and no savings and no assets, you're not going to get the loan. You have to have all of that. It's the credit score that gets you into the door, if you will, or gets you to pre-qualify for the loan, but it never gets you approved for the loan. It only gets you denied because if their minimum requirements are 740 and you got a 620, you're going to get denied regardless if you have millions of dollars in the bank and millions of dollars of assets because of the automatic underwriting or the automated underwriting system. There's no human looking at these applications. You put in the information, you hit submit, it instantly pulls your credit. They have a bot drop dead bottom number. And if you're not there, it rejects it. It's that simple. 